Welcome to back my channel and practice. This video is the third video in the series. Don't forget to watch the rest after watching the video. Listen to the fast and slow pronunciation of English words and learn their pronunciation. Learn the meaning of the English word in English, this is very helpful. We reinforced your learning with two sample sentences for these words, please try to understand these sentences. Let's start. Dust. Dust. Rachel dusted the books and the bookshelves. Rachel dusted the books and the bookshelves. I was dusting in the bedroom when the phone rang. Earn. Earn. To receive a particular amount of money for the work that you do. You don't earn much money being a nurse. I was the only person in the house who was earning. Educate. Educate. To teach a child at a school, college, or university. The Ormerid School educates handicapped children. He was educated at Bristol University. Employ. Employ. To pay someone to work for you. The factory employs over 2,000 people. We have been employed to look at ways of reducing waste. Empty. Empty. To remove everything that is inside something. Eleanor emptied the contents of the envelope onto the table. Did you empty the dishwasher? Encourage. Encourage. To give someone the courage or confidence to do something. I want to thank everyone who has encouraged and supported me. Cooter was encouraged to begin playing the guitar by his father. And. And. If an event, activity, or story ends, it stops happening or to make something stop happening or to finish what you are doing. The festival will end with a spectacular laser show. I think we'll end there for today. Enjoy. Enjoy. To get pleasure from something. I enjoyed every minute of it. Young children enjoy helping around the house. Enter. Enter. To go or come into a place or to start working in a particular profession or organization or to start studying at a school or university. Silence fell as I entered the room. Both the boys entered the army. Entertain. Entertain. To amuse or interest people in a way that gives them pleasure. She entertained the children with stories, songs and drama. A museum should aim to entertain as well as educate. Escape. Escape. To leave a place when someone is trying to catch you or stop you, or when there is a dangerous situation. He broke down the locked door and escaped. He escaped from prison in October. Excite. Excite. To make someone feel happy, interested, or eager or to cause a particular feeling or reaction. His playing is technically brilliant, but it doesn't excite me. He tried not to do anything to excite the suspicion of the police. Excuse. Excuse. To forgive someone for doing something that is not seriously wrong, such as being rude or careless. I'll excuse you this time, but don't be late again. Please excuse me for being so late today. Exercise. Exercise. To use a power, right, or quality that you have. There are plans to encourage people to exercise their right to vote. People who can exercise some control over their surroundings feel less anxious. Exist. Exist. To happen or be present in a particular situation or place. The custom of arranged marriages still exists in many countries. The club will cease to exist if financial help is not found. Expand. Expand. To become larger in size, number, or amount, or to make something become larger. Sydney's population expanded rapidly in the 1960s. Water expands as it freezes. Expect. Expect. To think that something will happen because it seems likely or has been planned. The company expects to complete work in April. Emergency repairs were expected to take three weeks. Explain. Explain. 
to tell someone about something in a way that is clear or easy to understand. The librarian will explain how to use the catalog system. He explained that it had been a difficult film to make. Extend. Extend. To continue for a longer period of time or to make something last longer. Management have agreed to extend the deadline. The government has extended the ban on the import of beef until June. Face. Face. If you face or are faced with a difficult situation, or if a difficult situation faces you, it is going to affect you and you must deal with it. The president faces the difficult task of putting the economy back on its feet. As the project comes to an end, many workers now face an uncertain future. Fade. Fade. To gradually disappear or to lose color and brightness, or to make something do this. Hopes of a peace settlement are beginning to fade. Over the years, her beauty had faded a little. Fail. Fail. To not succeed in achieving something. His wife seemed depressed, and he feared for his children. Fearing violence, the group asked for police protection. Fear. Fear. To feel afraid or worried that something bad may happen. His wife seemed depressed, and he feared for his children. Fearing violence, the group asked for police protection. Fit. Fit. If a piece of clothing fits you, it is the right size for your body. His clothes did not fit him very well. Fix. Fix. To repair something that is broken or not working properly, or to decide on a limit for something, especially prices, costs, etc., so that they do not change. He's outside fixing the brakes on the car. The government accused the two companies of fixing petrol prices. Flood. Flood. To cover a place with water, or to become covered with water. Towns and cities all over the country have been flooded. The houses down by the river flood quite regularly. Fly. Fly. To travel by plane or if a plane, spacecraft etc. flies, it moves through the air. He was arrested at Heathrow after flying from Brussels airport. The plane was attacked as it flew over restricted airspace. Follow. Follow. To go, walk, drive etc. behind or after someone else or to happen or do something after something else. The patrol car followed the BMW for a few miles and then lost it. After weeks of intense fighting, there followed a brief period of calm. Fool. Fool. To trick someone into believing something that is not true. You can't fool me with that old excuse. Even art experts were fooled. Forbid. Forbid. To tell someone that they are not allowed to do something, or that something is not allowed. Women are forbidden from going out without a veil. Force. Force. A group of people who have been trained to do military work for a government or other organization or violent physical action used to get what you want. In the end, he had to be thrown out of the house by force. The riots were suppressed by government forces. Form. Form. To establish an organization, committee, government, etc., or to make something by combining two or more parts. The winning party will form the government. In English, the past tense of a verb is usually formed by adding ed. Found. Found. The past tense and past participle of find. To start something such as an organization, company, school, or city, often by providing the necessary money. We also found a whole batch of papers which we thought might be vital to the war effort. Eventually, the spare key was found and they were released from the clutches of the car. Frame. Frame. To surround something with something else so that it looks attractive or can be seen clearly. Sarah's face was framed by her long dark hair. She stood there, framed against the doorway. Fry. Fry. To cook something in hot fat or oil, or to be cooked in hot fat or oil. Fry the potatoes, covered, for about 20 minutes. 
I could smell onions frying. Glow. Glow. To produce or reflect a soft, steady light. The fireplace was still glowing with the remains of last night's fire. The red tip of his cigarette was glowing in the dark. Grab. Grab. To take hold of someone or something with a sudden or violent movement. I grabbed my bag and ran off. Two men grabbed her and pushed her to the ground. Greet. Greet. To say hello to someone or welcome them or to react to something in a particular way. Bill opened the door to Harold and greeted him with cries of welcome. His statement was greeted with cries of astonishment and indignation. Guard. Guard. To protect a person, place, or object by staying near them and watching them. The sergeant told Swift to guard the entrance. There is no one to guard these isolated farms against attack. Guess. Guess. To try to answer a question or form an opinion when you are not sure whether you will be correct. I'd say he's around 50, but I'm only guessing. If you guess correctly, you have another turn. Guide. Guide. To take someone to a place or to help someone or something to move in a particular direction. He guided us through the narrow streets to the central mosque. He guided her firmly towards the sofa. Hammer. Hammer. To hit something with a hammer in order to force it into a particular position or shape. Hammer the nails into the back of the frame. All afternoon, Martin had been hammering away in the conservatory. Hand. Hand. To give something to someone else with your hand. He handed the teacher a slip of paper. This form must be handed to all employees. Handle. Handle. To do the things that are necessary to complete a job or to deal with a situation or problem by behaving in a particular way and making particular decisions. The finance department handles all the accounts. Most customers were satisfied with the way their complaints were handled. Hang. Hang. To put something in a position so that the top part is fixed or supported, and the bottom part is free to move and does not touch the ground. Philip hung his coat on a hook behind the door. She hung the sheets on the washing line. Happen. Happen. When something happens, there is an event, especially one that is not planned. It's impossible to predict what will happen next. This kind of thing happens all the time. Harm. Harm. To have a bad effect on something or to physically hurt a person or animal. The kidnappers didn't harm him, thank God. The most important consideration is that the environment is not harmed. Hate. Hate. To dislike something very much. It's the kind of movie you either love or hate. I hate to see you unhappy. Heal. Heal. If a wound or a broken bone heals or is healed, the flesh, skin, or bone grows back together and becomes healthy again. It took three months for my arm to heal properly. Some survive, of course, time heals a few wounds, wounds a few heals. Heat. Heat. To make something become warm or hot. Heat the milk until it boils. Clearly the salt water was heated in pans in order to drive off the water. This video is the second video in the 500 word video series. Please continue learning vocabulary with the fourth video from the adjacent playlist. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video, comment and subscribe to the channel. See you in another video. Don't forget to like the video, comment and subscribe to the channel. See you in another video.